Well, greetings and salutations, everybody. Welcome back once again, and for the very first time, to the Farts and Crap Show, where today, as per usual, it's your host, Anjo, here with part 14, I believe, of Final Fantasy Tactics, The War of the Lions, PSP version, running on the PSTV. Hope you guys are all doing well. And on today's episode, um, I did, we are going back to Ebro's castle because, um, yeah, Titra and Elma and Dysodarg and to a lesser extent Zalbog, uh, they're all in trouble. And Brahms's family is, uh, was apparently, uh, attacked or targeted or something and they don't really know what's going on except that it was probably the corpse, ugh, the corpse brigade. Um, but yeah, also from the last episode, I did look it up, and essentially a dovecoat is a small compartment. Uh, compartmented raise house? Or box for domestic pigeons? And it also has a second definition, but that's not the one they were talking about here. And I guess in one of the Shakespearean plays, like there was a line that was kind of similar, like an eagle in a dove coat, so may have had some influence on that line being in the game. But um yeah, it's a it's a birdhouse, basically. But uh, from the images I saw, it was um, a bit larger than like what you may think of when you think of like a pigeon enclosure or something for like carrier pigeons. Um, so yeah, that's what he meant uh, in the previous episode when Dysodarg was talking about how they need to check every, like check everywhere, even the dove coats. So when I was joking and mention like uh, what's a dove coat like um what doves wear when it gets cold it wasn't too far off and it's where doves go when they get cold i guess but um i guess for domesticated pigeons so yeah it's basically a, a birdhouse fancy birdhouse anyway but yeah Glad you guys are here today. I hope you're ready for another episode. It's, uh, yeah, it is part 14. Okay, cool. And I just thought I'd go in to the Chronicle, because each one of the menus has, like, its own theme music, and I feel like we hear the main one a lot, and not the, like, tutorial or Chronicle ones. I feel like as far as playtime goes in this series, you've mostly heard this one and the party roster one, so. But, um, yeah. E speaking of which, I think the party is pretty much good to go. Ramza is, doesn't need much equipment as a monk, thankfully. Um, Vilham might see some play. Want him to be a chemist for a little bit longer so he can learn how to use Phoenix Towns. Uh, Zerig is gonna stay a knight until I can get him a bow to be an archer. Sister Lily is now a time mage with black magic as her backup thing. And Christiana is gonna stay a black mage until she can get arcane strength. So that's pretty much the core members. Although we do have plenty of cash now, I could hire a new person, but I don't really care. Um, also, I was thinking it might be better to go to the Magic City of Garland first, before going to Egros, because I have a feeling as soon as we arrive in Egros, like some shit's gonna go down, and we won't have a chance to hit the shops. So... Oh, no battle. Okay. I mean... 
I think we need to go east here in a little bit, so we're gonna pass through Dorter anyway. And actually, I don't remember if Garland had stuff that we need. They don't have bows. We have leather plates. Oh, which monks can actually use. Okay, so that'd be better for Ramza. And I could get another shoulder cape, which I kind of want to do, because monks already have really good evasion. So yeah, let's do let's do that. Um, I also have a bunch of extra equipment I could sell. Um, but yeah, that is actually kind of helpful. So equip leather plate, okay, and shoulder cape. So now he'll have thirty percent evasion for physical, ten percent evasion for magic. So really not bad. Extra leather clothing and plumed hats, so... I did put the bronze shield on Zerig. Um... I mean, they didn't really have anything new for my mages, right? more potions, but we're still at 18, that's plenty. Alright, I'd say we're good to go. And now Dysodarg is also on his deathbed, which, I mean, no, he and his dad have that in common, but I'm told you handled your duties most efficiently. Leave the cleanup work in our brother's capable hands, and take a well earned rest. You've done well. Fear not for me. My wounds are not as grave as they might seem. Oh, brother. What? What of Tetra? Zalbog will lead a full-scale assault on the Brigade as soon as the garrison is found. But... The enemy is routed. Less than a score of their number remain. The leader yet eludes us, but time grows short for Vigraf... Full... Full ace. Fools. And for Tetra as well, who would leave her to her fate? Taken measures to ensure Tetris' well being. The attack waits upon her safe return, such time as they may require. Tetra is a sister to me. Oh, I thought Tetra was Delita's sister. Okay. I would never turn my back on her. Hmm. Think matters through, Delita. Where would you even go? You must calm yourself. Call myself. My only sister is taken by cutthroats. Oh, it is his sister. But Delta is not a direct relative of. Oh, it's she's like a sister to Dysodarg. Okay. And you would have me calm. I would have you obey reason. You know not where to begin. To search now would be fruitless. <laughs> you want to talk about fruit? Damn. It's a call back to the thing because <laughs> the sound effect anyway <laughs> I'm not over explaining this joke fuck it 
You speak of my sister's life. You heard my lord brother. He said he would not abandon her. But there's a little we can do. Tell it I cannot breathe. Forgive me, Ramza. Are you alright? Oh, I'll be fine. <coughs> I'd not believe a word of that fairy tale if I were you. Call my brother a liar. I do. I would not go out of my way to rescue some common maid. What did you say? I said you would be a fool to hold back an army for fear of spilling a few drops of your common blood. As I thought. Stop this, Delita. <laughs> release me. Damn you, Ramza, release me. It... What is that I feel? <laughs> Nothing. I... I mean, we're awfully close and... <laughs> you build very well, Delita. I mean, a man's posture would not, uh, <laughs> you know, do anything for me, but... <laughs> when was the last time you've seen a woman? All right. Do, do, do. <laughs> as, I've, as I've always said, come in blood, come in man. Never be more than you were born, Delita. You don't belong in our world. You will be licking our boots with the rest of your ilk, churl. That does it. Ramza, seriously, calm that thing the fuck down. <laughs> Enough, Delta. Are you as well, uh, and you as well, Argath? Open your eyes, Ramza. Delta is not one of us. I mean, come on, you clearly have your erection pressed up again. <laughs> He's just sitting there. <laughs> It isn't proper that you should mix with such as he. Surely you see that. Delita is my friend, and a dear one. We've been, bro we've been his brothers all our lives. You know, brothers that embrace each other from behind. <laughs> that blinds you from the truth. <laughs> You're a man grown, Bromza. Like, seriously grown. <laughs> Think I forgot what I grabbed back then? It's time you left your playthings, your boyhood behind. <laughs> Come on, really? <laughs> All right. <laughs> you, you are a son of House House Bove, <laughs> Bove. Okay. <sighs> a birth high, even among highborn. Such company ill suits you. Your brother see this, I am sure, even if you choose not to. Not everyone of high birth is ill-bred as you. I trust to Ramza's judgment. Be gone from my sight. Do not think to return. Your words cut deep, Ramza. Are we not friends? No. Remove yourself. I'll not ask again. Besides, you always do whatever the fuck you want during missions, and it's not helpful. The brigade makes its base at Zeikden. Your lord brother told me himself. You've no hope of breaching the fortress from the fall. Their defenses are too strong. A rear assault is your only a chance. <laughs> As usual. <laughs> Get out of here! <laughs> Best of luck, my soft-hearted friend. You'll need it. Be gone. I mean, Argath is definitely a piece of shit. Oh, damn. Damn. Three new places? Zeekden. Isn't Zeekden where we were before? Oh, Zeklaus Desert. Okay. Linnelian Plateau, Windflats. There is no town over there. Shit. 
All right, Egros. Well, as long as we're at home, why don't we do some outfitting? If they have any new shit, they do have longbows. I'll take one of those. Yep. Uh, also, is a buckler better? No. Bronze shields are better. Oh, that was funny. Um, okay, Iron Helm, probably. Yeah, let's just get let's get outfitted. Dragoon and Samurai, so bronze armor, yep. Iron Helm, yep. And Iron Sword is still the best sword we can buy, so... Sell... Because we definitely have shit to sell. I guess I don't need these shields anymore, now that we have two better shi Wait, one better shield, or two better shields? One better shield. Okay. Well, I guess I'll keep it for now. Um, I definitely don't need four long swords. Knight, Geo, and Squire. Okay. Definitely don't need five plumed hats, that's for sure. Sell, so, what, like three of them? Sell two of them. Also sell a leather helm, because I'm not going to need that for anything. And I definitely don't need three bronze helms, so I'll sell one of those. Um, leather clothing, I definitely don't need seven of these. I'll sell like... What, like four? Or three. I'll sell three of them. Pretty much everything I'm willing to sell right now. So yeah, we made back a pretty good amount of the cash. Alright, so Zerig, Whip, Iron Helm, Bronze Armor, up to 116 HP. Damn. So they're, they're all good. And apparently Delta is still in the party. Which I don't give a fuck, so I'm just gonna take his shit. Because I'm assuming he's gonna leave. Anytime now. Oh wait, I also bought the stuff for him to be a thief archer. Do I want to do that now? How is he level 2 archer? Has he ever been? No, he was an archer once. Like, real briefly. It's not bad. Okay, so he could wear leather plates, so I could buy an extra one of those. sell here. Okay. Tavern, maybe? <gasps> they do have a new rumor, okay. Uh, assassination attempt. While the Corpse Brigade has been vanquished, their leader, Vigraf Foles, continues to evade justice. 
and even as the Order of the Northern Sky worked to round up the last of the Brigade, former Brigade members led an attack on the manse of the esteemed House Beauvais at Egros. Their target is said to have been none other than Duke Larg's advisor, Lord Dysodarg Beauvais. Unfortunately, the attempt was thwarted. That's it? Alright. I probably had to listen to that to do something. I don't know. I don't know, man! Um... Should I try going to the Merchant City of Dorder first? I mean, they might have different shit. And we got something. <gasps> Cutscene. Oh, shit. It's beautiful, isn't it? Do you think? Do you think Teetra might be watching this same sunset? Don't worry, Delita. I'm sure she is well. Something's been bothering me, Ramza, for some time now. Argat's words trouble you. Am I not right? There are things beyond the power of our changing, Ramza. Try though we might. Do not say that. If a thing can be endeavored, it will endeavor. Grant me an army. I would save Titra with these hands, if aught were in my power to do. But I cannot. Tis my meager lot in this life. I, uh, kind of forgot that's what Delita sounds like. He says Delita, but I... That doesn't sound right to me. So, did he leave? Or... No, he's still right there. Alright. Well, I'll check the tavern. Oops, same shit. Outfitter, do they have new shit? Please have new shit. Could buy a red hood. Except, well, archers can wear them. Uh, but I already have a couple. Oh, I did say I wanted to get another leather plate. Um, because that would be eight difference. Also, an eight difference. Uh, leather plate is cheaper. Party roster, Zerig equipment. There we go. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and save and then check the Merchant City of Dorder, but we might have a battle in between here and there. But it's the only other place I can go for supplies right now. Yeah, shit. Had a feeling. 
And I mean, the experience would help, but I guess, Philham, you're coming again. And take Sister Lily and Christiana. Is this like my third battle in the Siege Wield? it is actually are there only two enemies or three yeah this will be this will be over real quick oh there's four okay a black goblin is that a stronger version about the skeletons anyway. Turn four? Just do a regular attack, fuck that. Yeah, 24, that's not bad. Uh, I could just, like, force him to go this way. Shit, that's right, I have a blind knife. I don't want to accidentally blind my fighters. That would be bad. no vertical to it. Um, you have the ice rod, right? Three left.
Shit. Oh, please move into... Damn it. I was hoping he would move in the way of that thunder spell. She's not a black mage anymore. Her cast time for black magic is longer. Damn. Damn, dude. Double kill. Thirty-three left, okay. Missed? Come on. That sucks. Oh, because his magic strength isn't that good. Oh, that blows. Okay, um... Six. Fuck. Of course he's gonna retreat. Such as cowards do. Use a Phoenix Down, yeah. And I don't, can't use items. Actually. 
actually, do I have anybody that can do that? I'm actually not sure. Haste wore off. Oh. Oh, Zerig can do it. Yeah. Okay. Good. Because I just realized I was like, hmm. That was one of my characters that can revive people. using phoenix downs because how expensive they are but Okay, haste is pretty sick. I'll probably get slow too, actually. I just need those three guys to... Okay, he's got a good amount of health left. Which, if I just attack him regular, it'll probably actually kill him. I'm just trying to drag this out to get the rewards. I'm just gonna throw a rock. And wait. It's the skeleton, he might kill it. Though, Wilhelm's probably fine.
that's not bad. He might just retreat now that his HP is so low. extra job points for everybody. already. That's a chant, right? Yeah. items already. Bad. Uh, 
Oh wait, but then the cure spell is not going to do anything. Or no, it will for Ramza? I can still use haste one more time. Seriously, it missed both of them? And I don't get experience. Cool. Great! I thought between the two of them, at least one of them would, you know... Get that, but whatever. Yes. Sure, I guess. I was... Hoping I'd get abilities for that, but whatever. Oh, because you can't hit things that are like right next to you, right? so I don't accidentally heal the other dude in case he goes for her. Wait, why the fuck is he... How did he get revived? Can skeletons just do that? The fuck? Uh, okay. Maybe it's just like, there's a percent chance that that'll happen? I had no idea. Maybe it's just for undead enemies, maybe? Huh. Well... Looks like we're not waiting for uh, these guys to... Actually, I could just use curative magic on myself. It's not going to be as powerful, but at least I'm not wasting a potion.
Actually, wait, I did... Fuck, he's gonna be get to go before... Oh, uh, that's not good. Crap. Maybe I can kill him before that happens? That'd be cool. gonna hurt like a lot My guys were KO'd, but they should be fine if I remember correctly. Because I finished the battle before the timer ran out. Zerig, Sister Lily, Delta, Christiana, Emmett. Yeah, okay. Christiana, Sister Lily, Zerig. Ramza, Willem, we're, they're all here. Okay. Um. Learn. Oh, he's at 300 exactly. Okay, so I can get Hummel or Aura Blast. I think Aura Blast is the good one. Purification, remove status ailments. That's a lot of them. But it's only... Oh, it's on yourself, but it has a radius. Okay. Yeah, I'm gonna get War Blast. Because that's, from what I remember, one of the better skills. We got Life Font, which I don't really care. Or Counter, which would have been pretty good. Uh, it's not something you always want, necessarily. He got to 200, wow. Okay, so Phoenix down. He already has Treasure Hunter. Probably learn how to use Antidotes. I guess I would switch him to being... What would I switch him to? I guess maybe a backup knight? Possibly? Or another archer? After all, he is already archer level 2, so that might be a better idea. I mean, he won't... He is just a backup guy, so... I guess for now, maybe a knight? I'm gonna hold off on him. Um, Zerig. Burn. 397, that's not bad. Oh, and Thief got unlocked. Okay, cool. Crossbows wouldn't be terrible. 
concentration. Uh, yeah, mix attacks, unblockable. That's pretty good. I could come back and get it later, though. Because I'd have to get rid of JP boost, which is... Not something I would prefer. This is speed, yeah, okay. Yeah, I don't really care about any of those. Thief? Steel Heart? What does that do again? Enthralling them. Oh, like they'll turn on their own guys. I think the. It doesn't work very often, though. I mean, stealing other pieces of equipment I would be much more interested in. Skill Snapper. Damage taken? That's kind of cool. Assume a defensive stance? That's not bad. Actually, that's pretty good. Poach. Deliver slain monsters remains to a poacher's den? Move plus two and jump plus two? Dude, that's awesome. I mean, it's one or the other, not and, but the fact that they have access to both of those, uh, that's pretty sick. I mean, I definitely would prioritize, like, stealing equipment. That's pretty sick. Alright, so let's go ahead and change his job to Thief. Because we need Thief for... Couple things I can't remember. It's something on the road to becoming a ninja. And I would rather him have the blind knife than what's his butt, so. Equip, Sarig, blind knife. He's got high speed, that's about it. That's unfortunate. High move, too, and jump five and five. Wow. Okay. Um, abilities. Oh, wait. Since he's being a thief now, I guess I can switch Willem to a archer? Yeah, I could do that. to, you know, get different skills. Like, he's not going to be part of the party all that often, but for when he is... Steel... Oh, steel is the default ability? Oh, but you have to know how to steal different things. Right. didn't get Treasure Hunter? I thought he did. No? How does he have 284 as a Black Mage? I guess he can't learn anything that I want to get right now. Uh, Sister Lily abilities, learn... Got 223 is Archer. You could get jump plus one, but I don't care about that. get her poison, but I don't care about that either. Uh, we could get float, which doesn't come up very often. Immobilize, which is okay when it works. I mean, slow is really fast, ironically. 
and a shield? Delta MP, no. Teleport, tape, both kinda good. I guess I'll get slow, it might come up and it's like pretty cheap, so. Christiana, you can now learn arcane strength. That is great. Yes. Okay. Which means she could also switch to being a time mage now. Which I'm not kinda have to do actually. If I don't really want to do that, though, right now, I mean, Black Mage is still pretty solid. And then I'd have to give up having White Magic on another character. Equipping the ice rod. Ooh, I don't know. I'm just gonna keep her as a black mage for now. Well, it depends what they have at Dorder. Fitter, no. Outfitter. Shit. It's the same stuff. Another leather plate or red hood, probably, right? Uh, the hood can be used for Zerig, I believe, right? Yeah, archers and thieves can even use them. Okay, that's worth it. Two leather plates, because I only need two, right? One for Ramza and one for Zarek? Yeah. Better. Yeah, yeah, we'll keep it that way. As for No, I'll keep metal on there for now. This, okay, yeah, this will be fine. Hey, I was kind of hoping they would have more stuff. To be honest. Um, but I mean, I did get an extra red hood, so it's fine. 
but we are over on time, folks. So on the next episode, we're going to head to Linellian Plateau. Hopefully I can get to Magic City Garland without anything happening. Perfect. I kind of figured since we just had a battle in the Siege Wield, so... Um... Yes. Do that there. Yeah. Yeah, so that's what we'll do. That's what we'll do. But, um, yeah, thanks for being here. Hope you guys enjoy. Of course, before we get going, a very special thank you going out to the current Bards and Crap Show members, which at the time of recording is Novalis Draconis, the one, the only. Thank you so much for uh, choosing to support the show a bit more directly. Greatly helps out, and we greatly appreciate it. If you guys want to be incredibly awesome like Novalis Draconis, uh, check out the join button down below or the Farts and Crab Show Buy Me a Coffee. Either way, membership starts at 3 bucks a month. It's only 10 cents a day. Gets you into all the basic stuff, including getting to vote on the series that get made here on this channel via the members' choice polls. Um, channel members basically get to decide what series get made. So if that sounds like something you want to get into and also get on the members' wall, that's how you do it. Um, we did already have the one for November that was to select this series. Uh, the one in December might not be for a new video series. It might actually be for streams because we might not have Tales of Zestiria quite wrapped up yet. So if that does happen, then that one's going to be in January. But, um, yeah. Because there's quite a few things I've been considering doing for streams, and some of those ideas are inevitably going to go on the back burner, but yeah, so anyways, thank you for being here, greatly appreciate it guys, Till next time, take care, and I hope you all have a fantastic day.